You said you have to ask Venus. When I asked recently whether aliens have made anything worse on Earth, why did you say this? What did aliens make worse on Venus? You also recently said some souls from Venus get stuck in the afterlife when they die and you reincarnate those souls instantly. Why don't you send them to their afterlife instead? <laughs> Does that mean that there are separate spirit wars for different planets? Do you only instantly reincarnate souls from Venus that get stuck, or do you do that for other planets too? Does that ever happen to humans on Earth too, that we're instantly reincarnated if we get stuck in the wrong afterlife? That's if there are separate spirit worlds. <laughs> What type of being inhabits Venus? Are they human-like or more what we would call aliens? How do they survive living on such a harsh planet environment? Or perhaps they're in a different dimension which alters the conditions on that planet. Can you explain? <laughs> What is life on Venus like? Is it like Earth or different? Worse? Better? Can you give me details, please? <laughs> Do Venus souls go to the same afterlife as humans? Other planets with intelligent beings, including Venus, do they all have to reincarnate over and over again like us on Earth? <laughs> Are they ever reincarnated on Earth as humans and us as aliens on different planets? <laughs> Oh, 
What else can you tell us about Venus? The veil that surrounds us while on Earth, which means we are mostly shielded from seeing other dimensions and other beings. Does each planet or server have its own individual veil? Is that why we haven't found other life out there yet? We just can't see it. Are we all coexisting with interdimensional beings, but we just can't see them? When we see a UFO, etc., is our perception opening, or is it our vibration or our energies overlap somewhat so we can see them? You've mentioned servers a few times recently, such as Venus Server, and how Guardians control the servers. Can you explain what a server is to you? <laughs> Does each planet have a server, or do you refer to each planet as a server? <laughs> You recently said Guardians control each server, so is each planet with intelligent beings called a server or do you refer to each dimension, plane or planet as a server? <laughs> What exactly do Guardians control with these servers? Is it the information coming in from each world, or is it something to do with the incarnation and passing of souls into the afterlife, or is it something else? <laughs> Is the spirit world also a server or has a server? <laughs> Is some type of technology such as computers involved in controlling these servers? <laughs> On Earth, we have video games where people all over the world make a character and play science fiction or fantasy avatars in a persistent online world. Each world is hosted on a server. Are humans on Earth something similar to this? To you, in the spirit world, are we just characters in a game? <laughs> Thank <laughs> you.